coming soon. Strange force has entered the galaxy. The future of mankind is at stake. It could only mean one thing. Greetings, Captain. Spock! I do not think you realize the gravity of your situation. Oh. The vacation is over. Now, the crew of the Starship Enterprise... Enterprise, are you ready? ...is taking adventure where it has never gone before. What are you standing around for? Do you not know a jailbreak when you see one? the mind of a madman. Hostile force has taken control of our vessel. Mr. Solo, full ahead. Through the center of the galaxy. You know we'll never make it through the Great Barrier. To the final frontier. Fascinating. How often have you done this? Actually, it's my first attempt. Fire the rockets! You never cease to amaze me. Nor I myself. This is the boldest trek of all. Warp speed now. Star Trek V, The Final Frontier. Mr. Scott, you're amazing. There's nothing amazing about it. I know this ship like the back of my hand. There's no question about that. He's so good he's got to die. The Birthright Gang has a score to settle, and they'll stop at nothing. But Bernadette Peters is Clint's biggest trouble, and he's hot on her tail. Once he finds her, he's in for the ride of his life. Yeah, I get a word for that woman. Obviously a hardened criminal. I can tell by the cupy bow lips. This is so wrong. Oh, well, this is, uh... Gray Day, U.S. Government Green. Give me a break. Too much raw dude for you, huh, babe? Well, I can dig it. If my life were a movie, there'd be a sign on saying, Caution, some scenes too intense for younger viewers. Yeah! <laughs> Clint Eastwood, Bernadette Peters, a wild pair on a fast ride. The room. Didn't anyone ever tell you you shouldn't mess with a man's vehicles? Pink Cadillac. Oh, no. I can give you so I can just drop the refrigerator in my head one more time. Well, I up on your head 23 times already. I can take it. Don't worry about me. I'm not worried about you. I'm worried about the refrigerator. This is the tale of an up-and-coming movie star named Roger Rabbit. And a down and out private detective Stay out. Ah! named Eddie Valiant. Booga booga! Every moment they were together ah! was a new adventure in trouble. Hide me, Eddie! Please. It's a motion picture about friendship. Take it easy, booga! Please, Eddie! Don't tell me I'm making a big mistake. Love. <laughs> Compassion. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry I yanked your ears. All the time he yanked my ears? Murder. Marvin Acme. A rabbit cacked him last night. Remember, you never saw me. Sex. I'd do anything for my husband, Mr. Valiant. Anything. And oh, violence. <laughs> Tunes. Gets him every time. You wouldn't have any idea where the rabbit might be? Got a thing for rabbits, huh? The whole thing stinks like yesterday's diapers. It's a comedy a little different from all the rest. Ah, I'm a pig! I'm a tomb. I'm not bad. I'm just drawn that way. <laughs> but tell me, Eddie, is that a rabbit in your pocket or are you just happy to see me? We tunes may act idiotic, but we're not stupid. Who framed? Roger Rabbit. Don't ever kiss me again. Who framed Roger Rabbit? Pink Cadillac. Star Trek V The Final Frontier. Three great movies coming soon to Super Channel.
nutrition. What is it and why in North America are we spending millions of dollars each year on dog food? Hi, I'm Norm Murray and welcome to Problems with Pups. There are a lot of dog foods out there today. It can be very confusing. Which one do you choose? All these dog foods range between $7 and $40 a bag. Why is there such a price difference in these foods? They're all basically made up with either chicken base or a beef base. Let me tell you a little something about dog food. Too many companies are taking shortcuts. They're using artificial flavorings, artificial colorings, too much salt, too much sugar. This is not good for the dog's metabolism. Finding a balanced diet for your dog can be confusing. If you want to make sure, look for this label. This is the CVMA label. This is the Canadian Veterinarian Medical Association certification that the food contained in this bag is of the highest standards. The CVMA tests, analyzes, and monitors on an ongoing basis to guarantee nutritional qualities. Look for it before you buy your dog food. Come on inside, I want to show you something. Canned dog food, there's a lot to choose from. But which ones do you choose? Would you feed your dog water? alone it's not much in it there are different types of dog foods or you can feed your dog food some dog foods have up to 80 percent moisture when you open a can look for this texture in your dog's food there's dog food and then there's food for your dog how do you guarantee you're gonna get food for your dog in each can? You have to look for this label, the CVMA label. This will assure you you're getting what you pay for. Mike is about to make dinner. not making dinner for himself. You've guessed it, he's making dinner for his dog. Stop. A balanced diet is not made up of sugar and spice and everything nice. A bad diet can cause your regular stool, weight gain, and ultimately shorten the dog's life. There are three important stages in a dog's life. The growth stage, the maintenance stage, and the senior stage. It is important to start a puppy on a good, nutritious, regular diet. I use dry dog food. Some are designed to have a greater benefit than the mother's milk. At this stage, bones are forming. Muscles and joints are developing. No doubt the dog will grow quickly. The next stage is the most productive stage of a dog's life. Its body needs energy to work, play, and be part of the household. CVA certified foods again meet these specs. If you have a dog, you work very hard. There are high performance foods formulated for maximum protein and energy source. After a dog has served you well, it enters a less active stage. A caring, responsible owner must reduce protein and fat intake. Too much protein late in life can affect kidney function. Too much fat can cause weight gain in a less active dog. Here's what all dogs need in their diet. Crude protein, crude fat, crude fiber, ash, phosphorus, and moisture. Here's the bottom line. If you're going to use a canned dog food, use a good canned dog food that is CVMA approved. If you're going to use a dry dog food, use a good dry dog food that is CVMA approved. Here we go again. Another big mistake. Cookies, candy bars, and doggy treats are all full of sugar and artificial flavoring. They're bad enough for our metabolism. Just think of what they're doing to your dogs. Now, I've got nothing against treats for pups. 
There's nothing wrong with giving a puppy a treat if you don't overdo it. And you make sure you give the dog something that won't do it any harm. Give your dog a piece of cheese or a piece of meat, but do this in moderation. We really can't be sure, but there is some evidence that suggests human foods can cause human diseases in dogs. I have a letter here that states, I have just recently purchased a new six-month-old puppy. When he's in the backyard, he eats grass and he vomits. Is there anything I can do about this? Well, I really don't know and I don't have the answer to solve this problem. But I do know that almost every dog I've ever seen eats grass and they vomit. People do say that grass is medicine. Well, in my opinion, anything that makes you vomit is not medicine, it is poison. Is there a solution? I haven't found one and either has my vet. Mrs. Joan Wood from Winnipeg, I'm reading in your letter here that you bought a three-year-old dog and his teeth are full of calcium and black junk. Well, whatever the black junk is, is probably from the diet the dog was on before you owned it. It can be cleaned up and the dog is probably three years old. Go to the veterinarian. He'll scrape all the calcium off and the dog will have a great smile when he's finished. If you would like a transcript of this show or have any further questions, please write me at Box 10. 24524-21B Avenue, Aldergrove, BC, postal code VOX1AO, or give me a call at 1-604-856-DOGS.